One of the most common questions we get at Exonius is, how can I show adherence to a cybersecurity framework like CIS or NIST when it comes to asset management? In this short video, we'll look at CIS controls one and two and how a cybersecurity asset management solution can easily meet these controls. First, let's look at CIS control one, inventory of authorized and unauthorized devices. More specifically, actively manage, inventory, track, and correct all hardware devices on the network so that only authorized devices are given access and unauthorized and unmanaged devices are found and prevented from gaining access. To achieve CIS control one, the Center for Internet Security highlights three key steps. One, identify all devices. Two, document the inventory. And three, keep the inventory current. Let's take a look at how we can do that with Exonius. First, the Exonius platform works by connecting to the different security and management solutions that a customer is already using. Instead of installing agents or sniffing traffic, Exonia simply uses what we call adapters to integrate with these solutions to collect and correlate information about devices and users. We have over 70 different adapters today and we're constantly adding more. Once the adapters are set up and the system starts collecting information about devices, we can see a long list of all devices here. The system is able to identify all devices, both managed and unmanaged. First, let's look at unmanaged devices, those devices that are only known to the network and do not have any agents installed and aren't part of Active Directory. Here we see a list of all unmanaged devices and some of them are okay to not be managed. For instance, a smart TV in a conference room probably shouldn't have an endpoint agent and wouldn't be part of AD. However, we always find devices that should be managed and are not. Next, let's look at managed devices. These devices have an agent or are part of AD and we can see a lot about every device. First, we can see everything that every adapter can see. Here, we see a Windows 8 device that is also a VM, and we can see everything that each of the adapters can see about it. We can also view the correlated information here. Every bit of information we can see can be queried, and every query can be turned into an alert. For instance, let's say our security policy states that only managed devices can be on the corporate network, or that every device that's in AD must have an endpoint agent. These queries can be easily turned into alerts, and alerts can be sent by syslog to a SIM to ticketing systems like ServiceNow or sent via email. With the Exonius platform, achieving CIS Control 1 happens automatically as soon as the system is up and running, as it inventories all devices, keeps a documented inventory in both Exonius as well as keeping your CMDB up to date, and the inventory is always kept current. Let's move on to CIS Control 2. CIS Control 2, inventory of authorized and unauthorized software, more specifically, Actively manage, inventory, track, and correct all software in the network so that only authorized software is installed and can execute, and that unauthorized and unmanaged software is found and prevented from installation or execution. To achieve CIS Control 2, the Center for Internet Security requires you to identify and document all software, develop a whitelist of approved software, manage the software on the system through regular scanning and updates. As we saw earlier, once we've connected the adapters, we're able to see detailed information about each device. We can see all installed software, vulnerabilities associated with installed software, OS installed security patches, and available security patches. In addition to all of the software installed, we can write queries to find specific software. For instance, show me all machines with Adobe software installed. And here we see, here's some Adobe software. We can do that with any software, and we can run any number of queries around the installed software. We can also create a query that says, show me all devices with known vulnerabilities. We can then create an alert to say, anytime a device meets that criteria, send an alert to my ticketing system. We can also tag approved software to create a whitelist. With the Exonius platform, it's easy to achieve CIS controls one and two out of the box, and that's just the beginning. If you'd like to see more, please let us know by visiting exonius.com. Thank you.